YouTube, Nightly Pop is back for another exclusive segment just for our loyal viewers, all right? So first up, reports are saying that Kim isn't just getting rid of Kanye, she's selling off the Yeezy sandals he gave her too. She posted them on her Kardashian closet website for almost $400. So when you guys break up with someone, do you purge their things too? If it's really nice, I'll keep it. Yeah. And then I just won't tell anyone that it's mm -hmm. from an ex-boyfriend, mm -hmm. but I've definitely gotten rid of some things. I agree, same. I don't keep anything. Yeah, yeah, I, I'm, I'm not a big fan of keeping stuff either. I, she did, one of my exes made really nice custom prints. Like it was art, it was really pretty, it was for like something that I cared about. I kept the frames, loved the frames. <laughs> 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 See, nobody's Sweet. talking about the fact that everything Kim is getting from Yeezy is most likely free. So she's making a profit mm -hmm. off of yeah. some she got for free. Yeah. I hate it and I love it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys, next people are sharing their bizarre JLo dreams. And this one struck an emotional chord. A man tweeted, I had a dream last night that Jennifer Lopez told me I had really let myself go. So for starters, JLo, rude. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> what is the weirdest celeb dream you've ever had? I had a really weird dream last week that I went on tour with Haim. <laughs> <laughs> what? I swear to God. Did you just see licorice pizza? No. Oh. No, I did see that, but this is months and months ago. Oh, wow. interesting. How weird is that? It's very random. And I was killing it. <laughs> So good. I know what I was wearing. I had a tambourine. I oh didn't really God. sing. Yeah. I was nailing the f out of it. I'm not going to top this. Hunter, have you had any celebrity dreams that are as cool as this one? No, no, just sex stuff. Yeah. <laughs> All right, you guys, Americans are confident in their cooking skills because 63% of them think that they can compete with a celebrity chef on TV. Y'all are crazy. Wow, uh, many? What percentage? 63%. Wow. That's, that's a little cocky. It's the same guys. You're oh, one of them? really? I totally think I could take that mother <laughs> Really? Wait, wait, which of the mother <laughs> Gordon Ramsay? All of them. <laughs> All oh of them. God. Bobby Flay? I mean, I don't know. I'm a little delusional, but I can really hold my own in a kitchen. You I would think get... I could take that guy uh, from Diners Drive Guy Fieri, dive. you couldn't. He thinks everything is good. You couldn't. You know. They would rip yeah. us all apart in a <laughs> no. kitchen. It would be so embarrassing. Guy Fieri thinks everything tastes good. He's never oh, critical. How do you say his name? Guy Fieri. <laughs> Guys, close enough. I like it. We would all get absolutely yeah, shredded probably. to death by them in a kitchen, especially if they went. You have so. an hour to make something. The stress would get to you. It depends no. on the food. It depends on the food. No, I mean, I make a great charcuterie board. Oh. Okay. Gordon no, Ram nobody is f***ing with me in the charcuterie Gordon board. Gordon Ramsay would. On no, your he would, no, he board. would not. Yeah, he would. Here's the thing. We're women, so we have psychological warfare on our side. Mm -hmm. So maybe I'm not busting the uh, the better meal, but I would be whispering in his. Ear just tormenting. Yeah, me. Like, I he probably cry and leave. Yeah. It's time to go. Okay, that's um, all the time no. we have time for today. Don't forget to subscribe and comment below, you guys. Goodbye. Yeah.